talking about espresso. This is the Barazza Sete. So I'm gonna open it up here so you can take a look at it. So if you're looking for a grinder, uh, this is a great grinder. And what I've heard, uh, I was on the phone with Barazza and they told me that this grinder is great for espresso. Well, look at this nice fancy packaging inside of here, the Sete. Uh, quick start guide. All right, first impressions. Um, the design is crazy. Look, look at that. It looks like a seven. Which maybe that's why they call it sete. I got right here a porta filter. Looks like it's gonna hold. This is where the porta filter goes. So you're gonna want to set that first thing. You can do presets. It has a manual mode if you wanted to. Okay, uh, that's the manual mode apparently. And um, and I I got it cranked down pretty far. I you can see that. I mean. For espresso, that, that's really good. For espresso, I've been using the Barazza Vario. Now this grinder is phenomenal. It kind of holds it okay. Um, there it is, it kind of falls out if you hit it too hard, but this is a solid grinder right here. Um, the controls are kind of a little goofy. I don't really like that about the control. This one, what I like here, what I like here is on the Sete, um, cooler design for sure. Um, and then this ring down here is really, really cool. What I like about it, which is better, it actually, it actually holds my porta filter. It doesn't fall out, you know. The Vario is a pain in the butt to clean. But this, I, you, you just turn this thing all the way like so, and literally, well, another thing too, you push these in, these pull out. Literally, this is the conical burr right there. This is part of the sete. Great design, engineering, super sharp. The next thing that we're gonna do is uh, look at an espresso machine by uh, Rocket. Ugh. Okay. So we gotta, first thing you gotta do is you gotta clear all this packing stuff out of the way. This is a cruel joke. This is a cruel joke. Why would they do this? Look, look at this mess. Well, here's the big reveal. <sighs> look at that. Oh yeah, that is smooth. Smooth, smooth, smooth. Look at that. Hot water right here. A little fancy thing for steaming milk. Brand new. Group head, this is called an, an E61 group head. This thing gets really hot, hence the sticker. It's not hot right now, but it will be. Here's the lever to activate the thing and then the water pump and then there's your water tank. The sete with the apartamento. I think it's a winning combination. And let's give it a shot. So we're gonna put our grinder in here. We're gonna actually select this 25 gram setting. We hit the button. <laughs> okay, I stopped it at 20. Um, here we go. It's kind of pretty full basket. Looks like it's good. We're gonna level it off on top. Take my tamper. We're gonna tamp it down. Uh, take our porta filter right here. Nice puck inside there. We're actually going to put it in the machine. So you hold it up inside the brew head. And you turn it. It's straight on. Put our cup in. And then we do is we activate the pump. That looks solid right there. Now what we're gonna do is steam some milk. So I have some delicious milk here. Uh, I spilled their delicious milk. I think the milk's too thick. There you go. Can you see? First drink. Let's try it out. So I really like it. I really like the Apartmento. I think this is a solid machine. Um, you can see right here, even hot water comes out. Hot water, clean, quick. Uh, this is a double insulated. Woo! That's hot. All in all, this is going to be a phenomenal espresso machine and pair it with the Sete winning combination.